It is very common when working in 3D to use a shaded or hidden visual style as it adds clarity and depth to your work. To take the display of the design to the next level, you can create a rendering of your design to visualize the final product. As you work through your design, you can add materials to the components in your design. Materials are assigned to components in your drawings from the Materials browser. The materials that are defined in the current drawing are displayed in the top pane of the Materials browser. You can easily assign a material to an object with a few simple clicks. You can also choose from many predefined materials located in the Autodesk library. Again, the process to apply the materials to the objects is simple. To preview the assigned materials, you can use a render preset to create a low or medium quality render. Using this method, you can quickly see the results of the assigned material and adjust if necessary. Once you have completed your design and added all the components needed to showcase it, and you are satisfied with the view created, you create your final presentation rendering. To do so, you select the presentation preset to achieve the best results. Keep in mind that it can take an extended period of time to complete a highly complex rendered scene. Once completed, you can save the rendered scene to an independent file format. Using this method, you can easily share the rendered scene of your design with those in your office or anyone around the world while protecting the intellectual data that you've created. As you can see, you can create a rendered scene to showcase your designs. Using 3D and incorporating materials and other visualization tools enables you to create high quality scenes of your designs that enable you and your customers to visualize the final product.